appreciative of what the group did today. And uh, I think it's what you put into the week and it points to Saturday. And then to be able to come out and, and play and make plays to win on the road, it's, uh, it's a good feeling. And I want the kids to enjoy it tonight. And then uh, tomorrow get ready to finish up at home, Camp Randall against Minnesota for the Axe. Four scored five touchdowns in eight minutes. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it was good. What a play by TJ. I mean, what a play. And and uh, he talked about doing that last week. I think I covered that Thursday, but you guys didn't uh, <laughs> show up. But, you know, I mean, that's to knock it down is a, a really good play. Uh, to get a pick is a really good play. To do both. And uh, that change, I thought, you know, we're able to, we struggled early, you know, kind of run the ball and converting. I thought offensively, you know, the couple of screens were big, you know, I thought well executed and, and, uh, and I thought that we got the running game going and, and really got a lot of contributions from all the backs and full backs. And uh, I was just told here, Corey, first time he's hit a thousand yards, that's good for him, but it's, it's good for the group. And uh, I thought there's just a lot of good things, and certainly you guys saw it. There's there's areas we gotta clean up, get better at, and and uh, we gotta do that. How did you get the running game going? It kind of went away to some other things. I think that you know try to change a little bit. I think we're able to um, you know kind of make not a couple adjustments, but the way they were playing us and fitting us, that might open up some things that we had ready to go to. But we just didn't go to them early, and and that was uh, that was big. And then I think, you know, just guys were getting on their fits. You know, a couple of the one Bradrick had was just nothing magical, but everyone everyone got on their, their guy. And I thought Bradrick stayed right on the track, right down the pipe. It was good. But I think it was kind of once we saw how they were playing us, we had a couple of different personnel groups going, got a feel that this may be good, and, and guys guys made it happen. And, and if, you know, I thought the quarterbacks both were efficient. And, um uh, Made good decisions and, and made some plays. It was good. Uh, can you talk, talk about Houston and the boost he gave you? Yeah, it was uh, he was good and he you know, gave us a couple of plays with his with his feet and, and I thought he made good decisions and and like I said I thought Alex did the same. You know it was good to see both contributed in a big way. Um, but Bart's Bart gives himself a chance. He's, he's a really good teammate and and uh, works during the week and it was uh, and we knew. Or we thought we'd have a chance to do some things that would get him going, and, and he, he did get us going. Well, he didn't have range hand today, but angle, he had it. It seems like whenever he, whenever he touches the ball, whether down in the, in the zone, that he contributes. I mean, what, what did he give you again today? Well, I think he he certainly does, you know, with the ball in his hand, but I think he did some great stuff. Yeah, absolutely. And and kind of got some things rolling, and. and uh, it was it was good and it was you know the guys executed the the, the touchdown pass to him I thought he did exactly what he should and um, but he, he gives us a, a he's been giving us a lot and I think he's getting better and I think we're getting close to getting Ram back so that'd be good. A lot of teams sell out to stop your run did Purdue do that maybe early I think early they did and and uh, similar to what they did last year uh, as far as kind of matching some of the personnel and and then I think. You know the combination of that, and you know the wind was a factor early, and and um, or all game, but I think that early for us in the in the game. But they did; they have a nice plan. I thought they played extremely hard, and and they have got some talented players, and so it feels good to get this win. Do you feel like your team lacked any energy in that first quarter? No, you know I think that it's uh, we didn't convert on some third downs. You know we had the one we had a chance for it early, and you know they made some plays, but I didn't think it was a I thought they were focused. I thought there was good energy. I thought there was really good energy, actually. And um, you know, you, but you have to still play. You know, Trell um, wasn't lack of energy that you know we dropped the, the opening kickoff right. But then did a good job of getting back on. That was the one thing that was disappointing. You know, the the start of the second half we get a stop and, and we really gave them two extras. We we turned the, the punt, the return. We fumble that and then they get the fake. Um, but no, I thought the kids were focused, and, and that I think. But the execution, you know, I think leads to it more than anything. When you went with Bart in the first half, and stuck with him. Was he giving you something uh, with his skill set that, that maybe Alex was? It was, and a little bit of what you, you know, we were talking about earlier with the, the the numbers with the running game and the numbers, and and 
any time that you can use the quarterback, you guys all know this, that, that all of a sudden you get one more, instead of handing off the tailback, you get one more blocker. And, and so um, I think that he did give us a little bit that way, and, and uh, I think it was good for us. And, and, and uh, it was, uh, he, he did some good things. And I thought he did some good things in the passing game too, but I think it was really, it was it was a good change for us at the time. Did you see, see him run the option when you were doing it? I did. <laughs> you did run the option, right? Yeah. They ran the four letter word. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you, you guys had uh, four penalties and you can't really do is there any reason for that? Yeah, because we were talking about what a good penalty free team we were <laughs> by you guys. Uh, you know, and we had a couple and they were big plays. You know, the Defensively, we had a couple, you know, getting antsy and jumping off, and, and uh, you know, we got to clean that up. Those are all that and, the, and some of the, the things in the special teams, and those are all those hidden yards that, that matter a ton, and that's in one area that we've got to clean up and we can be better at, certainly. Uh, and I think, you know, we know the types of games we've been in all year and would anticipate the next one being the same. We've got to do all we can to not give anything to the opponent. What led you to go with uh, Micah for, for most of the game there? The He's had a good week of practice and, and uh, liked it. And, and not, John's been doing some good things, but it was uh, just felt like it was it was going to be good. And it, when both were ready, and John did a good job coming out. So it's, it's it, you know, it's kind of rewarding some guys what they're doing. And um, it was good. <laughs>